So you might be in a situation where your iPhone is just not showing up notifications on its lock screen. Now this can happen for a few different reasons, but the very first thing I would recommend doing is making sure you are not on do not disturb mode. So by doing this, you want to scroll down from the top right corner and you want to go ahead and find this do not disturb mode option. And all you want to do is make sure this is not enabled. If this is enabled, that can pretty much be the reason why you are not receiving any notifications on your front panel. However, Let's say you're not on do not disturb mode and you have good signal and Wi-Fi and you pretty much should be getting notifications, but you still aren't. Well, the next thing I'd recommend doing is making sure your notifications aren't turned off. So by doing this, you want to make your way over to your settings application and you want to go into your notification panel, which is right here. So go find notifications, click on notifications. And here you can see there's a few different ways you can go and set it up. Now here where it shows you like count or display as, you can go and set this up however you want to, but this is where things get interesting. You want to go ahead now and make sure the applications that you're actually setting up have their notifications enabled. So you can see right here with the app store, if I go and click on app store, I have allowed notifications for this application and I have also allowed lock screen notifications. So if your lock screen notifications look like this for that app, well that's basically why you can't see that application on your lock screen because it's not enabled. So make sure that is enabled and you can go on from there. But another big thing is scrolling down and making sure your notifications are enabled in the first place. So you can see right here we have allow notifications. Why do I haven't even allowed notifications yet? So what you want to do is just click on allow notifications and that will then start allowing this application to send you notifications at that point. Like I said, if you didn't allow it, then that is pretty much the main reason you're getting into this issue. So make sure you've enabled it and that can also fix it for the most part too. If that doesn't seem to fix it, you can try updating your phone by going back into settings, scroll down to general, click on software update, and that may end up you know, fixing it as well. So those are pretty much the main ways to do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.